you, we got a big pile of stuff to do today, so don't burn the house down, okay? Oh. Keep an eye on your siblings, alright? Alright. And remember, don't burn the house down. Okay, come on, let's go. Let's get you new glasses. Mm. These ones are old. They look like you got beat up while you're wearing them. Well, we're just ordering them because they have to like make put them together and stuff. So we won't actually get them today. I hate that process. You pick them out and then you have to wait. You get to look like you're beat up still for a while. Yeah. You're driving. I'm not driving. I'm riding shotgun. Ding 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 I mean, I don't see enough water on the ground for it to turn the entire city into an ice rink, but that's what they're calling for. And the city trucks have been out dropping salt everywhere, and I don't know. No kids are going to school, which is why our kids are home, except for Robert, because all the kindergarten kids showed up, so we left him there. But we went and we picked up Jason and Arthur, and Rachel stayed home sick. Or sick. We haven't decided yet. But we're going out. Margaret needs to get pick out her glasses. Remember how she went to the optometrist? Well, now she's going to the eye buy and the glass assist to try and buy some glasses. Shut up! And then we got rubber chicken again. We're going to get Swiss Chalet again, just for us. Screw the kids. They can eat whatever they want around the house. This is date day. We don't buy the kids Swiss Chalet. We bought special chicken last night for the kids. I've already talked too much and messed up the scene. We'll just we'll move on to the next one. Yeah, also, I got to go back and see the doctor one last time. The hernia guy, Dick Doctor. Oh, I should probably not say that. Yeah, he's not really that, is he? No. What's a different Let's just do a different scene. I can't <laughs> call him the Dick Doctor in our vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know this? Yeah, I gotta go back to the doctor and he's gonna have a little peek at my scar and make sure things are okay. It doesn't hurt most of the time, it still hurts occasionally, but if I say anything about it, then I'm a wuss, so I can't really say much more about it. But it's all right. Gotta go see him one last time. And then I'm done with this whole ordeal, hopefully. Unless, of course, the mesh decides to get rejected by my body and I pee it out and go down in a blaze of pain, blood, and glory. It's to the mall. The mall of spending. Give us your money. All of it. Twice. Your whole paycheck. We're lost. So now we gotta find where we gotta go. What are you looking for? Now, fast. 107. So, we should see it. Yeah, it's this floor. This is the ones. This is floor one for the hundreds. Yeah, so where right, is it? Two hundreds. It's gonna be up there. Is it outside, I wonder? No, it's inside. We're right, we're right here. It's supposed to be. We got that. Oh, there it is. <laughs> you found it? I like those. Those are like hair glasses, but you don't want to wear well, the same kind of glasses I would wear. Well, a heavy frame, yeah. Oh, they're not wide enough for my face. You see? Yeah. Sexy secretary. <laughs> I, they're, they're too narrow. And then, I don't like how much they go below my eye. Do you see that? Yeah. I think your head's are brown. Yeah. These are so bright. I tried on quite a few pairs of glasses. Uh, I'm going to try on more. Because, like, they all make your, your cheeks look bloaty, eh? I know. 
Well, I just don't like the shape of the crayon. So it's first round, but it's definitely pretty. Mm -hmm. That is cute. This is the final stages of choosing the glasses. What do you think? Two frames. Are you going to like what you see in the morning when you put those on? Are you getting somewhere? Yeah. I just found those ones for the blue. And the the gate spades? No, the... Oh, I always get those extremely really confused because they, they both have nice blue ones. Yeah, they both have nice blue ones. See, these have like a... It's a bit more squared off at the bottom. These ones they frame your face nicely, too. Round it at the bottom. But those ones are better because they hang down farther. You like that? Yeah. Well, because you, you have a big head. I mean that in the nicest possible way. But <laughs> in the you, nicest way. You have yes. a large noodle, right? I mean, yes. no, because you're Dutch, right? That's your... I gotta your say, I've seen a lot of heads in here. That's not a large no, head. No, that's what I was thinking, too. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, how are you doing? And I have it at the bottom. Your yeah, eyes are more centered in those lenses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd say so, too. Whereas the other ones are a little bit wider that way. What do you think? But the shape is different with each pair. Yeah. I think we have a winner. Yeah. Well, that's done. One thing off the list. What's I was next on the so list? I'm so anxious Doctor. with like glasses shopping because I don't really know. Like some people, they, they pick out glasses and they're like, yes, I know exactly what I want. And I don't know exactly what I want or what kind of looks good on me. So I'm always like, well, did I a, get the right one? You get kind of a bulbous round head. But, so, and it's like same with like sunglasses. I never know what looks good on you with sunglasses. Good thing the windows aren't fogged. Mm, no traffic. <laughs> Margaret, I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to film uh, when we're going to see the doctor. No, you some doctors don't like them that. In after. Like, why don't you just like talk about the doctor? Because no one wants to see that. That's not quality vlogging. What, talking about an appointment after it happened instead of like yes filming the people doctor? get bored of that oh, I see. i'd rather film more of the doctor's office than just be like so this is what happened because as soon as i start talking people are like why don't you just ask him if we can film because he's not the kind of doctor that's going to let us film in there well then he deals with hernias okay. and stuff and he's a surgeon is this really I'm not stressed out. Okay, so who cares? You can just tell them about it or not. Like, <laughs> honestly, love. It's not something you're stressed out about. Who says I'm stressed? I'm not stressed. Mm -hmm. Do I look stressed? Yes. Well, I'm not stressed. <laughs> Late and Margaret's driving like a race car driver. We're not late. I'm gonna puke. We're not late. Okay, it's 10:53. My appointment's for no, 11. No, that's three minutes fast. It's only 10:50. Then why are you minutes. driving like a bat out of hell? I'm not. I had to get out before the bus came along. That's the only thing that you were like. I ah, almost I lost my lunch. I yeah, I did. For heaven's sake. I was looking you down at my drive phone. Way worse than. Me. I drive like a damn stock car driver. Okay. Exactly. So you should stop. <laughs> Open, says me. <laughs> That's my superpower. <laughs> okay, so we're here. I gotta go in. I probably can't film in there. Hopefully the doctor doesn't have to look at my willy again. I don't like it when the doctor has to look at my willy. Your phone thinks you're driving? It thought I was driving. I just tried to hit record and it was like, I can't film while you're driving. I'm not walking that fast, mate. Okay? <laughs> Yet I could turn it on while you were driving like a bat in the hill. We gotta go. Ah, oh, it's always such a maze, isn't it? Look at the poor ATM. It looks like a lonely droid from Star Wars just tucked away in the corner. Poor thing. Alright, I guess I'll have to fill you in on what happened in the doctor's because I can't really film in his office. I don't want to be that guy who sneakily films in the doctor's office. That just feels shady. Yeah, well, only bad people film and people don't know they can't film.
<laughs> well, that went well. What do you think? It was good. It was good. It was a necessary step to feel like we were on the right track. You needed to have that validation, right? I did, in fact, make the doctor think I was a big 12 year old. <laughs> Just talking and being myself, and he's like, what did he say? He hasn't grown up yet or something? Oh, I think he just said he's a big kid. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. He's a big kid, isn't he? <laughs> you are a big kid, though. Okay. Oh, well, you're interacting with the lonely hallway droid. Well, I wonder if I can choose. Okay, peeps, we're gonna end it here because you don't need to see any more of our boring life today. We're going to the rubber chicken. You already seen us go to Swiss Chalet like yesterday. So you don't need to see that. We're going to Swiss Chalet. We're just gonna go home. I'm gonna take a bunch of pictures of toys and film toy videos and stuff like that. So you don't need to see that either. So I guess today's adventures are over. Oh, and by the way, the doctor didn't have to look up my willy, which is what I was afraid of. Yay. There we go. Everything is good, healing up nicely, and the doctor didn't have to look up my willy. All is well in the world. Okay, everybody, that's all for now. See you next time. Bye. Holy jumping, it's bumpy.